Grand Blue releasable before Frosty Faustings, right? So many of these online tournaments, WASD, TNS, and tearing it up at every oh. other scene. Man, Zippy and Elsa were just trading blows too. back and forth, and now seeing them over here at CEO 2024 Grand Finals, who can be surprised? Yeah, no doubt. I mean, these two, again, getting those sets in last night, they yep. were still, you know, going toe-to-toe -to -toe against each other. And like yes. I said, in terms of resources, and we saw it earlier in this bracket between these two where they had their set, and it was still very close in terms of resources. Unfortunately, Elsa came out on top on the side for Zippy here. Yeah. So we'll see how Elsa continues that play. But Zippy looking really hot right now, especially when you look at that set against Zero. Yeah, exactly. Just running the casual saying, all right, we're going to have to run into bracket eventually. We might as well mm -hmm. warm up and play at our best. Like you were saying, toe to toe, grippers for grippers. We got the death claws and the uh, death grips. Oh, so many good metered options from Nier. So I think what's really going to yeah. make the difference going into this grand final set is how we end up leveraging the meter. Do we want to save it for all the damage guaranteed off of the SSBAs and the supers? Or are we going to use it for these ultimate skills to try and hold on to pressure? Yes, that's right. I mean, look, the last time these two played against each other in this top eight alone, 2-0 in favor of Elsa here, right? Yep. So we're trying to make a turnaround. Uh, the way that Elsa has been playing, looking back, it's been nothing but clean sweeps across the board. Like, yes. like I said, 2-0 for Zippy and 3-0 over Zeron. Potentially, Zippy is going to go, I mean, excuse me, uh, Elsa yep. is going to make another 3-0 run against Zippy here. But also, looking at Zippy's run through loser's side. Yeah. 2-1 against Wavy, 2-0 against Nitro, and as we just saw, 3-0 against Zeron. Yeah. We're feeling very good on the trigger for 5-L, but that's not going to be the case in this match in particular because putting out a button lingering against Nier means death can potentially with punish you from an extended range. Exactly. You know, the 5H so strong, and we can use that as that spacing button, but there are so many ways to stay right outside of range of it, call death, and all of a sudden you're starting your turn, setting it up with that 50-50. Or, you know, maybe we got to pull out all the stops for grand finals here, resetting you, putting you back over to the mid-screen, and starting up that pressure where you don't even yes. think the combo's over. Yes, indeed. Time will tell. Thumbs up. We're locked in, warmed up. Misses the dad. There it is. <laughs> there here we go. go. Ladies and gentlemen, CEO 2024, let's hear it for Grand Blue Fantasy versus Rising Grand Finals. There we go, the nearer to end it all. Are we going to let the intros rock for one more time? There we go. I can't let you get away with that. You said the nearer <laughs> to end it all? Oh, Lord. We're getting nearer and nearer to the end of CEO 2024 as far as Grand Blue is concerned, but going to be holding on strong here. Both two of the strongest nears in NA as we head on into it. If you're not with us, you're against us. So true. You know, it's good to know that Nier is a team player, okay? Yeah. Like, they, honestly. She's playing the 2v2 before 2xko even comes out, but immediately putting death out onto the screen. The ominous turn, run up with that spot dodge. Zippy finds the first hit. All right, that's huge. I feel like we are definitely locked in if you're Zippy right now. To call out a spot dodge like yep. that is huge. Locked in and warmed up. Elsa maybe a little bit iced out, waiting, sitting pretty in the winner side of Grand Finals. No, but still able to make the jump out with the JH. All right, let's play a little bit of volleyball. High Q is still in theaters, as yep. it were. To the top, more like for the top rope. Finds a cross-up situation, but Zippy has seen that setup one too many times. There we go, 5H. We keep death as a threat, but look at that. All skill turn, let's return to the mid-screen here. Opportunity. We'll walk back out, the clap of the sandals, but no, we're gonna send out the ultimate turn. Run up behind it, catches you with the 5H. I wonder what we sniped out from Elsa. Maybe an attempt to jump out of the corner. Yeah, no kidding. Like. I wonder if we still tried to snipe with a turn of our own and yet we just sent out death. Yeah. Either way, Zippy looking really strong going into this round. All right, Glory. with the walk back, single turn into the death grips. Oof. There we go, EX take off. There it is, the 5L from Elsa here, but we still have control of the momentum on the side of Zippy. Yep. Ooh, set up the turn, nothing found off of the frame shot, but still the ultimate gonna go right on through all the time in the world for Zippy to run up and start using some buttons for pressure. But no, that's death off of the screen. Guard cancel out, nice, alt skill. Yep. Stagger two and the way that you are spending this SBA gauge is insane, but you've gotten so many beautiful openings off of it. Raging chain follow up here. Do you have enough to send it home? And you do. The EX Flurry closes it out. Zippy taking the first game in a quick fashion. He had one more stock. No more meter to cash out onto the rest of the diamonds, but still able to seal it out. So close there with the resource situation, but clutches it up in game number one. 
you know what? You got the hyper focus hat on. It's the gamer That's hat, true. right? Like this is the hat that you play high stakes poker in. Yep. Like you are just locked in right now. Don't let them know your next move. <laughs> Let's go gambling. Oh dang it! <laughs> the jump H. It's a wrap. Elsa taking the first opening gambit here. There you go. Knocked on the door with the five L. Got the death command queued up, but it's still not enough. Elsa loses a turn once again. Zippy quickly evens up the life lead. About even on health, about even on resources all around. Yep. Like I said, the set, the, that's the story that those sets ended up taking, is that these two went toe-to-toe -to -toe every single time. Yep. Immediate SBA spin. Let's close it out. Elsa taking that first round in game two. There we go. The pillar comes up strong. Looking rough on the back foot from game number one, but all right. Got a little more wind in your sails here. Respect. That's the round start gambit. Respect doesn't spend death right away here. Tears it down on the side of Zippy, so Elsa maintains that control. Yep. All right, looking for the vacuum. Nothing found off the death turn. 5L, the immediate interrupt. Zippy trying to reinforce the run up, but still, nine stocks to your name, has to hold the ultimate death clause. Ooh, a little bit too early on that spot dodge right there, so we do get called out for that counter hit. Big damage, not quite building up for SBA yet, but look at this, 75%, seven stock, substantial life lead. I, th I think things are looking good for Elsa. Pretty decent to try and seal out this next game, right? But the JU sniped out by the death turn. Ultimate claws, gives Zippy a lot of time to run up. We're looking for the screen space here. <laughs> Yo, okay, we still back the turn with our own guard cancel. Yep, BC for BC, back in time and back against the wall here. The double down back, looking for something Jesus. off the turn, but it's a turn of momentum for Zippy. Send it into the SSBA. It's still not enough to kill, even with no diamonds to your name. But now it's one touch for both sides. No! I was going to say, Jensen, did you see what diamonds were on the field? I there weren't a single one left, Jensen. Not a single jewel left, you're right. I was with you for right. a little while, but I'm like, ah, wait a minute here. I should have known all the damage in the world, especially on the low stock situation. All right, tied up one apiece here in game number two. Yeah, very smart spend there to try to tie it up. Nice flurry and perfect range for volleyball. Yep. There you we'll go. take the chip, absolutely, dash M, and we'll do it all over again. Thank you for allowing the work to happen for me. Not quite enough in terms of resources to seal it Ooh. out. Yeah, ultimate turn, the bone cruncher getting you so much corner carry here. Now we go for the vacuum, two to you. Your time will come, have to be so patient here. Elsa locked into a corner position. The 5L does work out. We have to be careful on the approach because death is now active. Yep, super jump back. We're just trying to wait it out. 5L to interrupt once again. Zippy at one touch. Ooh, finds a hit in the roll through. All right, what's it going to be? We just need that single touch here. But the moment that Elsa moves is when death activates the jump. Ooh, tried to lock you down, but just a little bit too late on the reaction. Elsa able to get so much screen space. Good Chip damage about to be a factor for Zippy. So many ways Yorkos. to try and look for this checkmate, especially as your 13 stocks come right back up. Elsa, how do we escape? It's one touch apiece, but no meter behind it. Elsa ties it up one, one. What was so critical in those last few moments was the patience that Elsa had showcased in that corner, waiting for the time on death to be restocked and available so we can go for that chip situation. I mean, we had all the time in the world. We'll certainly try to snipe out a single hit yeah. if allowed by Zippy here. And that just means that Zippy would have to make a critical mistake in that corner pressure while death was down for Elsa. But the patience pays off. Unfortunately, the 2H is certainly going to pay off way more here for round start. Yeah, it's a big counter hit to start it off. Waiting for the meter to come back up here immediately, just queuing up the vacuum. 5H, can we set up the 50-50? No, drop on the vacuum. All right, so interesting jump arc right there. No anti-air. Death wasn't active, but a strong lead that might just get eradicated here by Elsa in the sequence. Yep. Bounce right back in with the 5H into Death's ever-loving arms. Once again, Jesus. the cross-up setup. I really thought you were going to land same side this time from all the way across <laughs> the screen, but Elsa with the pickup post cross-up. That's a round. Yo, that is threading the needle if I ever saw it because uh -huh. we were so committed to just crouch blocking that interaction. Had we stood up and blocked, we'd have a different story entirely. You don't have to worry about your left, right? Exactly. Didn't want to commit to the guard button there, but Zippy yeah. thought his defense was a little too nice, and that's 5L to stop death in her tracks. Good dash L, late tex, not looking good. That's all damage off late tex? Wait a minute. Yeah. <laughs> The chip damage looking a little insane. Look, we even have the full combo, but it's tied up on the damage still. But Elsa looking to try and keep her turn. The ultimate charge on the death claws. 
go. Another flurry here. Watch out for ult skill. Nice spend, but we have a guard cancel. Elsa trying to maintain control. Deathclaw's right behind. Ooh. Zippy on the HP, looking like he might need a stim pack, but is able to find the jump in against Elsa. 50 meters still available for a clean setup. Ultimate skill. I assume we're going to look for the claws up here in the corner. All right, good block, but it's still your turn here. We didn't spot dodge the guard cancel. Dash L. Oh, you opened up, but why four? Oof, opened up the door, knocking on it with a 6-6L. Thought that we would go for a reset after, but sometimes he's got a frame trap with a 5L. Elsa is one game away from taking the championship home. I don't know how deep you are in vampire lore, but as we all know, <laughs> if the vampire asks if they can come in, you do not let them in. So do not invite just people knocking at your door like that. It's true. Yeah, opening up, trying to take your turn back. A little bit greedy off of that. But still, heading into game number four, let's see if Elsa is able to keep this momentum up. Blocks out the misfortune, and damn, is that unfortunate for Zippy. Strong lead here for Elsa with a 2-H, able to set up the medium special. Ooh. I was wondering if we're going to see the counter BC, but Elsa being a little conservative with the BP. All right, there we go. A little back special there. Ooh, little shimmy, walk there back, walk go. forward, looking for the Brave counter, but a Brave run up from Zippy just opting to take his turn. Oh, hit the reset, final stock here. Yep. Both players are in a touch for kill scenario, and Elsa will seal out the first round of potentially their tournament victory. The SBA send the screech to the skies. Elsa, one round away. Look how stoic Zippy is right now yep. on the setup here. All right. Ooh. No anti here quite yet. There was a nice little cover on the jump in, though. Yeah, just about frame perfect with the same input from the turn, but just so close up next to it for death. But Zippy still able to run up and take his turn instead on Elsa. Seven stocks to your name. Dash up, couple five L's. We take away a brave point here for that. Yep. Delay on the vacuum. Death still big chilling behind you. You got to be careful of the ultimate call. Ends up on the same side. Here we go. 2M. All right. Death turn. Just waiting. Standing there menacingly. It's a 2v2. Yo. No. 1v1. Reduced down. No partners here. Yo, these quick 5Ls right now from Elsa. We're getting shades of Zippy here on this one. We're making quick reactions to shut down Death before Zippy has an opportunity to return the favor on offense. Yep. Jump Oof. U activation, so that puts a trap right there. Install so we can make sure we have extra cards available. Zippy wants to shut this down here, and now it will succeed for the round. But you still have one more to advance on and try to survive in this tournament point scenario. Here we go. There's so many options that you have off of a 100 meter, but when you're at that one stock situation looking to try and seal it, that so chip right. damage, the install is so smart. Zippy, one round away from tying it up. Elsa, one round away from sealing out the tournament, and we started with the death grips. Yeah, I mean, it's the bread and butter, right? We're at five stock right now, locked in, waiting for guard cancel. That's not coming quite yet. Zippy's not going to give it up. Not at this life deficit. Ooh, send it with a bone crusher, but still, all you got was the plus frames off of it. That's 50 meter down the drain. Oh, wow, far H. Oh, <gasps> opened up by the 2L. Yep. Opportunity for Zippy to turn the tie, but you see these stocks, two left. If you can't get super yet, all right, you have to hold off on the cancel here. Ooh, that is a big whiff on the death claws right there. Able to give Elsa just a little bit more room to breathe in the corner. Trying to send something with the ominous turn. One stock apiece, 100 meter available. It's a stare down. Yeah, so final touch scenario on either side. The first one to spend is Zippy. So death is down. Ooh. Spot dodge, and Zippy will close out the game here. It's 2 all in this grand finals. Two apiece. Zippy stays alive for one more game. Man, that was terrifying. Just staring at each other with the fully loaded guns. Walk back five paces for the duel, but we're heading on into a game number five. One game away from sealing it out, but one game away from a reset, too. That was insane. The stare down right there with the final stock scenario. Both knew the risk of who pulls the trigger first. That's yeah. the most terrifying aspect. It's high noon here in the grand skies of Grand Blue Fantasy versus Rising. Let's hear it for this grand finals, folks, because this is spectacular, Grand Blue. There we go. That's what I like to hear. Both of our players, I think they're fine with taking a quick break right before that game number five. Had to settle the nerves with a quick deep breath, but we're heading into it. Final game of your grand finals. There we go. Flurry. Nice. Ooh, what a call out with the 5H. Are you kidding me? Death is down for Elsa for a little bit here. Big opportunity for Zip to pile on the damage. Ooh. Roll through. Pretty brave coming out from Elsa, trying to avoid some of these death specials right behind them. All right, here we go. Bring it back. Nice. 
Goes for dash H though, so we do have a full screen scenario. Woo! Stop! Nice alt skill usage here. Elsa tried to lock it in and look at what a brave 5L again. Uh huh. We could have just let the uh, flurry rip, but the way that Zippy is activated right now, calling out these small scenarios. This is a big boon for Zippy. There we go, now we're evened up on the life total. Still, Elsa has so much to work with. You have to be careful of that parry. You do not want to swing into it. 50 meters still available oh for Zippy, but caught up with the 6-6-L. Six, six okay. It's tournament point, Elsa, once again. Tall order one more time here for Zippy, but not impossible. Cracking under pressure right now would be detrimental for Zippy. And a Ooh. jump over from Elsa is a big way to open up. Gotta show it. We have a lot of strong anti-air tools, but sometimes you just gotta jump forward. But instead, Zippy with a cross right under evens up the life total and then some. Yeah, I mean, all the visual noise there. Spot dodge all you want, but eventually I will get my guard cancel. Ooh. Dash L call out here. Big follow up from Zippy. We can't spend here. You may as well. You're down to the last two stocks. Yeah, awkward spacing on the UDP, so we're not gonna be able to kill here. I wonder if we could have gotten a micro dash 2M just to be able to seal out lethal. But Ooh. Elsa, one chip damage away, but also 50 meters in the tank this hit is brutal oh my goodness we are sending it home no brave points left the throw that late tech was going to deal some damage but holy smokes the 5l interaction again from zippy tying it up in rounds we're still holding on to this tournament point potentially at reset zippy is locked in my heart is racing i can't imagine yeah. what it's like for the competitors right now we send the ominous turn even after the jump in that previous round unafraid to re-represent but elsa once again catches zippy out very good two age just cycle right back into the death setup here alt skill just to go for the plus frames yeah. and still trying to make that side swap but zippy is ready for block Big chill and return back to the mid screen here. Barely any health to your name. BC for BC. The guard cancels coming up strong and still two diamonds apiece. Masters out with the two M. You cannot charge a death call right there. That's two times now we've gone for the medium version of these death specials. And Zippy is so awake right now. You cannot test reactions at this point because Zippy is fighting for their life. He's locked in on the Red Bull. So much red on the HP, but it's a full blue for the SSPA. You've got to be careful of the parry too. And that's the finisher for Elsa all the way across the screen. We were staring at the death, locking you down in the corner, but all you had to do was send the SBA. Elsa is your champion of CEO 2024. I can't believe it. I didn't, it wasn't even a thought in my mind, and clearly not a thought for Zippy at that yeah. point, because I had no, I, I wouldn't have thought Ooh. we'd rip SBA right there. There's no way, but we did it with that. What a call out from Elsa.